So, perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar, and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. And Talyaspor have opted for a 4-5-1 formation, it appears, Jim. Well, this setup, Peter, can be very defensive if that midfield is in place purely to form a protective layer in front of the back four. But it can also be the launch pad to very quick counter-attacks if you can offer pace and accuracy on the front foot, it can have a, a devastating effect, actually, uh, at the offensive end of the pitch, too. So that's got things on the way. Shai Shu. He's on a charge. Shashu with the cross. Gets good distance on it. Hoists it forward. Shashu. Shashu. Gorgeous control there. Well, we don't even need to look at the stats, do we, Peter? Zero attempts, zero goals, and uh, excitement, forget it. And Talia Spohr have a free kick. he's looking for a really good feat plays it out to the flank whipped in It's terribly unfortunate for them, and maybe we can attribute that to a, to a loss of focus. Fortuitous as it may have been, they all count one. Well, you can't ask for much better than that, Peter. Bang, bang, two in double quick time. And Talia Spohr went ahead through an own goal, and the score is 1-0. Shashu, beautifully done. Shashu with the cross. Tries to locate someone up front. And that's been levered clear. Oh, 
Giroud really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. We hit half time. Well, there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. That's just been exhilarating, Peter, and leaving everyone wishing for a little bit more, but we'll have one manager now trying to exercise more control, so we can only hope that they go at it again in similar fashion. And Tagaspor come in, having established that lead, again, where the narrative is, at least in terms of the scoreline, so far so good. Well, the action has already resumed here. And Tagaspor carrying a one-goal lead. Time to deliver. Shashu with the cross. And the shot! And he's there to make a great save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Promising cross. Keeper has beaten it away. Good to pay. Have just about every. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? The ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Forward it goes. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. And helps available out wide. Plenty waiting in the middle. Plays it back. Going for goal! About up to 75 minutes. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the message they're sending out now is pretty loud and clear. Let's grab a second goal and, and give ourselves an element of comfort. Played out to the right. Oh, that's neat. Looking for a decent ball in. Gets on the end. Big chance! It's a carbon copy of the previous miss. And Talia Sport really are in the ascendancy here, and they know they have to register while that's the case. by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0.